Hmm. What's he doing? Adrian? You didn't see him leave? If anything has happened to my son, you'll be held responsible! You're such a strange uh, kid. Who would want to be at school when he could stay at home all day? You don't get it, Plague. I've had enough of being shut up at home by my dad. I want to meet people and make friends. Go to a normal school like everyone else. Uh, I think I'm feeling weak. You know what's strange? The fact that all you eat is this disgusting, rotten-smelling camembert cheese. And then I have to smell like you 24-7. That's strange. If you want to be able to transform into a superhero, then stinky cheese is the deal, my friend. You've reached the voicemail of Gabriel Agrest's office. Please leave a message. Hi, Father, it's me. It's parents' career day at school, remember? I was hoping that you were gonna show up. Call me back. You okay? Yeah, whatever. Nothing new. Marinette will come around and pass out some croissants baked fresh this morning. Thank you, Mr. Dupin. <laughs> now, let's meet Alia's mom, who is head chef at the Grand Paris Hotel, owned by our mayor, Mr. Bourgeois. It's beautiful! <laughs> Look, don't touch. Put it away, Chloe. It could get in the wrong hands. <laughs> I wonder how many croissants your dad would have to sell to buy you one of these. What am I saying? He'd have to sell the whole store. <laughs> well, if you're so rich, obviously you don't need free croissants. Ugh, jealous. <gasps> Is that camembert? It's not camembert, but it is very shiny. I like shiny. Unfortunately, I have no dishes to share, but maybe Monsieur Bourgeois will invite you all to the hotel and treat you to lunch. <laughs> Jeez, is there a day when you're not tripping over something? Next on the list is Sabrina's father, a policeman, Officer Roger. I've been a police officer for 15 years, and I firmly believe that every citizen is innocent until proven guilty. <gasps> My bracelet! It's gone! I had it a second ago. <gasps> you! You stole it! What? What are you talking about? You purposefully tripped on my back so you could steal my bracelet! You're a policeman! Arrest oh, her! My daughter is not a thief! <whistles> Hold on a minute, Miss Bourgeois. We don't accuse without proof. Now, everyone calm down, please. Maybe you simply misplaced your bracelet. <gasps> You're calling me a liar? Daddy! Roger, I demand you search this girl! Huh. Please, everybody! Need I remind you that, as mayor of this city, I am your superior? But, sir, it's against the law. I can't just go... Oh, right. Then you're no longer a police officer. Mayor, you can't be serious over a missing bracelet. This is my daughter's bracelet we're talking about. You're incompetent and you're fired. Get out! Uh... uh good. Let's call Ladybug. I'm sure she'll actually do something. I am the mayor of this city! Where's the school principal? I want to see the principal! I won't bother you with the story. It's a long, boring... Oh, yes, you will explain, and fast! You realize we have a big problem here, don't you? If by big you're referring to my rock-hard abs, why, thanks for noticing. And now we have a bigger problem. Hey! You can't just walk in here. I can go wherever I want, whenever I want. I am the law. Well, I'm the authority around here. You are guilty of obstructing the path of justice. I sentence you to move around. Oh, wait, I can't control my arm. What are you... What do you mean I can't transform? If you transform, the bracelet will get absorbed with me and damage your powers. Ah... I, I thought it was a camembert box. Anyone can make a mistake. You're always thinking with your stomach. Wait. <laughs> a bit of pepper. Gazoom <laughs> time. It's right in the middle of something very important. What do you want? What? 
This is unacceptable. The sample garment doesn't match at all. All you had to do was follow a pattern. Imbeciles. What am I supposed to do? The show is in three days. No, don't use him. He's completely useless. Call my assistant, Natalie. She'll give you some other news. He hides stuff behind the painting of Mom? Oh, I love dirty secrets. Oh, yes, go on, go on. I can't do it. My dad wouldn't like me going through his stuff. Besides, I don't even know the code. And my fencing class is about to start. You're such a party pooper. What? No! Uh, my, my, what have we gotten here? A book on Tibet, uh, an old flyer from a hotel, a load of old junk. Come on, where's the good stuff? I've seen this book somewhere before. But who cares? I'm famished. I need camembert. Why is my dad keeping this locked in a safe? Uh, Hawk Moth? What's this monster doing in a book about superheroes? Cheese, didn't you hear me? Uh. Adrian, mm. you're going to be late. I was looking for my homework, silly me. <laughs> Cat Noir! I'm in great danger of losing big bucks if my guests leave Paris! You are going to get rid of those pigeons, aren't you? Of course we are, but before we do, I have an urgent need. An urgent need? I see. Head to the royal suite. Ah, there's paper in there. But perhaps you would prefer a litter tray? <laughs> uh, oh, right. No need for litter. But, um, could I have some camembert? Uh, mm -hmm. Excuse me, sorry. Emergency! How do you like your camembert? Ronnie! Uh, okay. Unpasteurized camembert matured for two years. Thanks! Exhaustion. My poor aching body. I can't move a muscle. You want to bet? <gasps> My gooeyness. Eat up, buddy. Ladybug needs help. You have one new message. <laughs> Gotta get a drink of water. I'll be right back. <laughs> Plaid, you pig! You have one new message. Move, please, so I can check my voicemail. Hmm, don't recognize this number. Oh no! Now we're late! Time to transform, Plaid! <laughs>